Welcome back to the Booze Buddy Update for Thursday, March 10th, 2022. Well, I discovered this news last night, briefly talked about it on my radio show, but well, did you know that I actually have a radio show? It's called The Highway to Mel on 106.7 WYZN, WYZN.com. But of course, ACDC is the inspiration for that name. And ACDC and Knucklebones have teamed up with New York's Great South Bay Brewery to create For Those About to Rock, We Salute You Ale. The first 500 orders will receive a 15 inch by 12 inch print for the limited edition brew. Knucklebones, by the way, best known for their highly collectible band and musician statues or garage kits. And they've started limited lines of beverages with ACDC, including Power Up Juicy IPA and TNT Double IPA before this that were made with Calicraft Brewing Company. For all the figures and the beers, head to uh, the link that is in the show notes. And speaking of shipping beer, it's the biggest issue with beer drinkers right now. 92% want to purchase beer and have it shipped directly to them, but under 15% of the 21 plus population in the U.S. can actually legally have beer shipped to them. Well, while restrictions that were initially temporary and in some cases have been permanently lifted to allow local deliveries from restaurants during the pandemic, no real long-term solution yet exists for that direct-to-consumer shipping. It leaves many people out of the loop, needing to drive potentially hundreds of miles when it comes to getting a beer they want to try or one that they even know they like. One thing is for sure, direct-to-consumer or DTC interest is not going away anytime soon, and the market seems to be on the precipice of growth. And we now know the real reason you're having that glass of wine every night. It's to stay healthy. But then how big is that glass again? Anyway, an analysis of health data for over 312,000 people suggests that having wine with your meals is associated with a lower risk of type 2 diabetes. Now, I'm no doctor, but I'm pretty sure that classifies as pretty great news. Now, it's not a huge glass you should be drinking, and you should limit it to the recommended amounts, which are 14 grams or about 150 milliliters of wine a day for women, and up to 28 grams, about 300 milliliters of wine daily for men. That's according to the article, and you'll find that link Link in the show notes as well. The Booze Buddy Update is brought to you by Green Mountain Payments, helping small businesses, breweries, and independent business owners who need affordable merchant credit card processing solutions, point of sale solutions, and expertise. You can go to GreenMountainPayments.com to learn more. And are you interested in live streaming? Look for the Booze Buddy Update on YouTube, Facebook, and especially LinkedIn, where I need more followers to be able to do it there and give me a follower, give me feedback. Why live stream? Well, because then you could participate in discussions on episodes of another round. So I think it'd be pretty cool. Remember, don't drink and drive, stay safe, drive sober, and support the booze that supports your local community. And I'll see you again tomorrow.